This is a very big set. We don't even have it all put together, but we've got the big bridge put together. We've got the stands put together. These look like drops. We've also got these crystal rocks put out. Really interesting is that Thomas and Percy both have their own colored trailer, sorry, their own colored uh, car, flatbed, if you will. All right, Liam, we got Thomas and Percy here on set. This is the first layout. This is a big set. It took a lot of time to build. Are we ready to get going? Yeah. Three, two, one. Off he goes. Past Cranky and Bullstrode, and up he goes. I gotta stand up, this is a huge set. Let's climb up, and this is going to the Crystal Caves. He looks very happy to be here. As he's gonna hit the first rock, what's gonna happen? Goes down and sits in there, goes over the bridge. Will you hit the second rock? Yes, and the second rock lands in there as well. Thomas coming back down from far away, back through the mine, and he will keep on going? Yeah. Okay, I wanna see what happens here if the balls fall into the cart. Oh, and they do, look at that, fantastic. And then he stops here. Oh, okay. And then Cranky um, picks up the crystal and then puts it on to Bullstone. Now let's go get the orange crystal. Oh, look at this, and then you can change the, the way that he goes. So now he's on the lower track, he's in the lower mine. Coming around the mine, when he comes, and he's gonna drop it down in there, he comes on the other track. And we've got two crystals. Cranky and loading up Bullstrode. Has been loaded. And then Bullstrode goes away because Bullstrode's kind. Comes with six of these crystals. Let's go with purple and blue. We'll put purple here and blue in here. Let's see if we can get one train going high track and one train getting low track. Okay. Oh. oh, and Thomas is already knocked off. Let's get Percy going. Percy looking really good. Thomas off in the background. They will just be our track conductor. We'll see how these guys do. As Percy knocks over the first crystal, lands it in there, then knocks over the second crystal. Thomas off in the distance. And now here's Thomas. He's picked up the blue one. I sort of missed that. And Percy will collect his crystal. Okay, you load him up. I'm going to get new crystals in here. Thomas coming around and he's going to take the high road. Percy stops over at the other side. So we've got Cranky loading up from Percy. Hey, and here's going. Thomas knocking over the crystals. Percy gonna grab the first crystals already. Let's see if we can get all six crystals on both roads. Good job, Percy. That was a really quick exchange right there. Thomas takes the high road and he'll get his crystal. Now getting ready, which means we've got two more crystals. Thomas the tank engine off in the distance. Jim's gonna stop him, I think. And what going on? Oh no! Percy drops the crystal and his trailer's off track and off time. Thomas loading up, no problems for him. Percy now has to come through. And will he stop oh. for Cranky? Will Cranky get loaded? It looks like Bullstrode has almost a full load. Percy's still off. Here comes Thomas, the tank engine, down the number one line. Will he stop at Cranky? He does. Cranky the crane loading up, and will he be able to get six on Bullstrode? Yeah! We did it! We did it, that's great, but here comes Percy, and oh my goodness, Percy, what happened to you? And you're dropping crystals all over the place. Good job, Bullstrode. Now Liam, let's see if these guys can go the other way. Let's start off with Percy. Ready? Percy coming down, which way is he gonna go? Off the tracks, good. I think this you can go both ways on this track, which is really good. Let's see. Okay, drops boulder number one, drops crystal number two. Come down now, look at this, he just dropped it and now he can pick it up. That's efficient, way to go Percy. This is a faster way. Stops a cranky, now we have a little bit of problem there. Liam just figured out that this thumb thing actually turns cranky. Well, Percy come down. Percy's going to snake all of this. He's going to take all the crystals away from Thomas, the tank engine. Gets it in the second one. Here he comes. Which one's going to make it? Will there be a malfunction at the junction? It looks very close, but Percy pulls ahead of Thomas, the tank engine. Stops at Cranky, and Thomas pushes him out of the way. Good job, Thomas. Oh, that was so close. Oh, my goodness. Look how close it was. Percy knocking over crystals. Thomas going to collect them up. Uh oh! Oh no, look at this, Percy now pushing on Thomas. The ball is falling out. What's gonna happen? Percy looks, oh! Percy crashes, Thomas survives. Last engine standing here on the Crystal Cave set. Layout number two, we're gonna go this way. Liam, go ahead. Thomas goes first, and he will come under and pass Bullstrode. Let's get ready to release Percy going straight. Thomas is gonna knock over the first crystal. Knock it down, oh no, and it didn't land. Percy will knock it over. Thomas knocks oh. over the second crystal, and he gets it. 
He gets a second crystal. Percy was playing soccer and Liam's got that fixed. Oh wow, Liam kind of. Wow, you really have to conduct this. Okay, he's got Percy on pause. As Thomas the Tank Engine comes down, he's gonna get too cranky. Will he stop and get loaded up? It looks like he will. Here's Thomas the Tank Engine, and he'll knock over the first crystal and knock over the second. Looks like Percy now is going to, oh wow, he missed this. Look at this, this is actually off basis. Oh no. And here comes Thomas, he's got one crystal. Will he be able to load the second one? Oh no, the second one goes all over the place. Percy, oh no, and Thomas didn't get stopped. He's got two crystals, we got one on the track. Oh, he's got another one, look at that. Almost a malfunction at the junction. Here comes soccer playing Percy, and he stops at Cranky. Oh no, because here comes Thomas again. Oh man, this is a crazy setup. Okay, we got a lot going on. We're trying to fix this. Will Thomas knock it over now? Yes, he does. And he goes over and here comes Percy. Maybe Percy will catch it. Now it's working, Liam. Get Percy under the go. And here comes Thomas picking up his crystal. He's got the last crystal. Cranky loading Bullstrode. And there's Percy. But here's the last crystal on Thomas the tank engine. Percy in the foreground. Thomas way out there. But here's Percy climbing hills and over this awesome bridge. I love this bridge. Thomas coming in for the win. Will he get loaded by the six crystal? Liam using Cranky and it's six crystals and Thomas is away, Percy is away. Okay, let's try it going the other way. Which one are you gonna send out first? Looks like Thomas a tank engine and he's gonna go straight, which is good, because the other one's a loop. But gonna, oh, and here comes Percy. Thomas coming down the line. I think Percy might be the faster of the two. We put batteries in at the same time. But here's Thomas and he will knock the first crystal down, come over the bridge and knock the second crystal. No, he missed the second crystal. This is a little bit of a tight setup. This is a long way to get that first crystal. Percy's now caught up to Thomas. I hope he doesn't derail him. And by that I mean I hope he totally derails him. Oh, look at that, and Percy got derailed. But Thomas, I don't know if it is a race or not because here comes Percy and he's gonna say, hi Thomas. Oh, and Cranky says, goodbye Percy. Okay, Percy catching up to Thomas again. Thomas releasing the crystal. Here's Percy right beside. Okay, they finally, they needed a little bit of help, but they've got that crystal. Here comes Thomas and Percy. Are they gonna stop? No, Thomas the tank engine will get the first crystal. Oh, and Percy just derails them right off the bat. Okay, let's not interfere at all. And Percy gets knocked over and Thomas, look at this. This is just terrible. Oh, he got the trailer back on track. We'll get the second, and he gets the crystal. Here comes Percy. And will he load up? Good, we've got another crystal. Looks like Thomas the tank engine is getting loaded by Cranky. Percy coming up. We've got to load up and shoot some more. Here's another one. Thomas and Percy just barely missing each other. Thomas will knock this crystal over. Each engine has a crystal and they will go. Looks like Percy's about to get loaded. Liam, are you gonna stop him? Quickly, God, Percy, good stuff. Thomas coming through, Percy in the background. Oh, look at this, I think this is gonna be good. Thomas the tank engine will unload this purple crystal right here. And then Percy will come along and load it up. And that works absolutely perfect, good timing. Here comes Percy down the line. Okay, and Thomas has the last one. This is a lot going on on this set. Cranky loading up Percy and here's crystal number six. I think this is the most confusing out of the two setups that we've done so far. Over the bridge and far away. He'll be coming down the mine shaft when he comes. Is he gonna get stopped here at Cranky? And they've already got it, fantastic. And Bolstro gets loaded up and off he goes without dropping any crystals into the ocean. This was setup number two. This one was a lot more confusing than setup number one. No matter which way you went, uh, there was a lot of accidents. Layout number three, this is another massive set. It really is big. This was a lot easier to put together than layout number two. We did it very quickly. Oh, and off goes Percy. And here he comes, he's gonna go down Bolstro. Thomas also released. Going through Cranky right away, and he will come down and go into the mine. Thomas hot on his tail, but it is Percy McGursey coming on up, looking very scared, and he will come over and knock this over. In the meantime, Percy has knocked over the blue one, and he is, will pick it up as Percy comes into the docks. And here comes Thomas. Oh, Percy already released, and he's already ready to knock up the second one. Let's get these going. Percy unable to finish this and he has knocked over that one and whoa no, we got Scott, oh, that's okay. All right, Percy coming down and he almost got two but here comes Thomas the tank engine, he will come around and get loaded into Bullstone. Liam gonna load him up right away. Thomas gets loaded right away. Percy didn't get stopped, oh my goodness, what happened? That crystal got loaded and so did this one. What's gonna happen here? Percy hot on Thomas's tail and that crystal just causes confusion and delay. We're gonna have to reload that one. Damn. Uh-oh. 
Uh oh. And that crystal got knocked off. Oh, oh. and Percy gets crashed too. Thomas the Tank Engine loads up on his crystal. Percy is, is now go. We have three crystals. Here's number four. Oh, look what accident we have. Oh, and that comes down. What happened? Oh, no. Crystal number four. And now Thomas has crystal number five. We've got crystal number six in standby. Let's get Percy back on track. Tom is coming down. This crystal's already been knocked over. That's kind of the problem with these things is that we've always been having problems loading two crystals with these guys. Load it up quickly before Percy gets it. Oh no! Malfunction at the junction. Maybe we can stop Thomas the tank engine here. Coming around when he comes in. Oh, oh and I got it at the last second. Look at that. He did, that's a shortcut. And will he stop? And he dies, and that's it. That's the sixth crystal. Bullstrow's just gonna drive away. Bullstrow drives away safely. This is great. Let's try and get these going around the other way to see if it works. What do okay. you think? Okay. On your tracks, get set, go! Off they go. Percy coming first. Now it's Thomas the tank engine. Percy coming around. This is the opposite way, so this is a good way to go. As he will go under, but there's no crystal to be had yet. He's coming up through the mine. Thomas hot on his tail. Will he knock over? This might be very close. Look at this. Oh, wow, that was perfect. And it landed right in there. Good job, Percy. Percy has knocked this one over. And he will get the orange one, and he goes right away. This is a quick one. That's the first one gone. Oh, look at this. Liam found a shortcut that he can go this way. Thomas already unloaded on bolster. This is a faster way. Look at this. Percy now knocking one over, and Thomas is going to load it up right away. In the meantime, Percy has knocked over the second one, and he's going to get that one loaded up. Thomas coming up the hill with the crystal. Percy gets his crystal and immediately gives it to Bolstro or uh, Cranky. Is this not the fastest thing you've ever seen? This is very This is efficient. really efficient. Look at this. We better load this one up and that one as well. Thomas now coming into Cranky and he'll load up to Bolstro. But in the meantime, Percy going to knock over this crystal. Thomas comes around. Percy knocks over the second crystal. Who will get their crystal first? I think Thomas will get the orange one. And then Percy gets his purple one. And look at this, this is crystal number five, already ready to get loaded. Thomas the tank engine coming up top. Let's see him coming down. This is, I think, my favorite track layout so far. Track layout number three, and it goes this way. This is like really fast. And the ship is full. The ship is full. And Bullstrode set sail. Good job, Bullstrode. Layout number four, this is the longest track. We do have spare pieces, so it's not the most built up, but this is really just takes a big footprint. Yeah, are you hits. excited? Mm -hmm. Liam, are you all oh, Percy, right off the bat. Heads down, and here comes Thomas the tank engine. Let's see what happens. Yes, it is going to be hard. They're going to miss the, uh, the track where it goes down by the docks. That's a separate piece. Look at this, and we timed it a little bit better. We could have had this right on the money. Percy knocked over the first crystal and he knocked over the second crystal. Liam really repaired those. As they go off into the distance, they're going, they're taking a long way around. There's no doubt about that. Oh, oh no, and the track was changed. Hurry, get him on track and on time before Thomas catches him. Percy, got that really scared him. He's gonna catch the first crystal and he's gonna come down this way. Thomas is gonna get changed and go back the other way. So we're gonna load up at Cranky as Thomas picks up his first crystal. And Josie has replenished the crystals there. Knocked over and one in there. Thomas the tank engine. Percy's back on track and he will go that way. And Thomas is knocked over. There's a lot going on. It is hard to film, I'll tell you guys. Percy now has another crystal. I'm sure Josie's going to launch that one up. As here comes Thomas the tank engine. But what's going to happen? He has a crystal and he tries to launch another one and that's a mess. And Thomas has missed his turn off. Oh no, he was going to go to Bullstrom, but he's missed his turn off. Percy gets his crystal. And Thomas tries to get another crystal over there and he misses. It looks like Percy is going to go low crystal number four. Thomas is coming out. And he will load up crystal number five. He has crystal number five. Will he load up crystal number six? Looks like it was a miss, but so we got it right back in there. Oh, and Percy misses it, but they're going to take turns loading. This is going to be very quick. Oh, and it's a derailment. Unbelievable. The ship is loaded up. Here comes Thomas. Say hi to Percy and Bullstrode goes set sail. Yeah, this is another confusing one. Let's have the trains go the other way and see what happens. Here we are, final run. Are you ready? Is there something I want to try real quick? Okay, let's try it real quick. Oh! <laughs> Double crash. Percy coming around and he's going through this. This is the last run, I think. This is our second setup. Thomas now on his way. Percy McGursey will come up and he will knock the crystal into position. And then he will come over and knock this crystal into position. Liam already setting up. He knows what's going to happen. So Percy will get his first crystal and he will go into the rounds. 
with Bolstrode and Cranky. I will have to go take the long way again as he gets his first crystal. Thomas the Tank Engine now with his crystal. Percy's been loaded. We got one crystal on Bolstrode already. And here's Thomas and he launches that crystal, comes over the bridge, we'll launch the second crystal in position. What's gonna happen here because he's coming down and will he knock it over and he does, he misses the mark. Oh, but we did get it in there and there's, oh, look at that, Cranky. Oh, and Thomas misses that one as well. He should have gotten it in the circle, but that was a mistake, that's okay. We're gonna have to switch the points here and get this ready to stop. Thomas coming up now, he has another crystal. It's gonna happen and he's gonna launch this other one while Percy comes through and gets this one loaded up. There we go, we are on our way now. Thomas coming through and he will launch this one. Coming back, Thomas the tank engine will load it up. The points get switched and he will come around and face Bolstrode now and Cranky. So here is number four. He knows that there's no way that's gonna happen. What's gonna happen here? Oh! Unbelievable! And Thomas now in the rounds, Percy has to Get on track and on time as Thomas is stuck going around in a circle. That's okay. We're gonna switch the points. Here comes Percy now. Here comes Percy. He will launch down, get the crystal in position, and then go around and collect it himself. Boom, he has the crystal. Will he get into the rounds? And he does. The points are in his way. Crystal number six comes in. Stops for Cranky. And they've loaded him up. Yay, Bolstro gone. This is a like this is the biggest footprint out of all the sets. Guys, what was your favorite setup? One, two, three, or four? I think number one was the best. It used the most pieces, that's for sure. Number three was the quickest when we went the one direction. So you can use this with any Thomas and Friends engine. Yes. Whether it's all engines go or not, that's quite all right. All these Trackmaster engines will work. They will go both ways on every layout that you have. You can use this setup. Yes. This is a really great set. I actually really enjoy this set. Yes. What did you think of it? Uh, right. Liam, what did you think of it? Cool. It was pretty awesome, wasn't it, guys? Yeah. Absolutely love it. Thank you so much for joining us here today on Kids Toys Play. Yeah.